All right, so this is the last and final tip to improve our overhead mobility. Up to this point, we've talked about stretching the myofascia of the lats and pecs. We've talked about the mobilization of the thoracic spine. And then yesterday, we talked about the mobilization of our ankle joint and how your ankle mobility can actually affect your overhead mobility, believe it or not. And then lastly, we're gonna talk about stability. And so sometimes, granted, it's not a mobility issue getting your arms up overhead and going into an overhead squat or snatch, it's a stability issue, and we'll talk about that here. So when we go ahead and raise our arms up overhead, I have to have, be able to keep my pelvis in a neutral position, but I also have to have these deep intrinsic muscles of my spine and core stabilize my spine so that I can then access the mobility of my hips. And so if I've got a weak core and those stabilizers, stabilizers don't kick on, my body's not gonna allow me to go deep into those squat and those positions. And so one common thing that we see amongst CrossFit athletes is when they go up overhead, they fall into this tilting position, which then throws, shuts down some of the abdominal muscles and limits our mobility, the hips and even in the upper back into the shoulders. So I'm gonna give you a couple of exercises that you can do to improve that. And so one that comes to my mind that we like to do here at Back in Motion Sport and Spine is to take some resistance bands. And from here, we're going to just kind of go up in that overhead squat position, but then you're just gonna kind of drive forward, but then let the bands pull you back a little bit. And you should feel your core muscles kind of kick on as you go into that position. So it's gonna try to pull you back so these stomach muscles gotta work. From here, you can also then Hold the bands up overhead, and that's gonna pull you back so you gotta really stabilize the core. And then just do a little bit of your overhead mobility work into the squat. And that will start to fire some of those intrinsic muscles. And so again, I would probably do these, you know, three sets of 10 to 20 repetitions, and you want quality versus quantity. So there you have it, that is the final tip to improve your overhead mobility, reduce your chances for injury, and to be a better CrossFit athlete.